Hi, I'm Charlie. I'm Anna. And we're Masters of Environmental Data Science students here at UCSB. And right now we're at NCs and we just revealed the final capstone projects to our cohort. Um, so the proposals are a chance for students or outside uh, businesses or organizations to pitch their potential capstone project, which would then be um, voted on and you know assessed by the committee and then passed on, if they are accepted, passed on to the voting round for students. And then um, based on some interesting algorithm, uh, those teams are designated. And then later on in the winter and spring quarter, um, the students in, all, in their groups will be working on those capstone projects. Um, so, depending on like, what project you're working on or what you think you might be doing after graduation, this is a good, a good chance for students to get something that they can really put in their resume, put in their portfolio, put some nice data visualizations in there. It's a great project to pitch to potential future employers or maybe for different education down the line, whether that's another master's program or a PhD program. And I think they help us take skills that we learn in class um, and in our curriculum and apply them to real world issues, working with real agencies and real businesses, which I think is something you don't typically get the chance to do. Um, like a lot of final projects just sort of deal with this theoretical proposal that you propose and then that doesn't necessarily go anywhere. So we actually get to get hands on and get nitty gritty with environmental issues. So a really wide range of different organizations can propose the Capstone Project, whether that's a government organization or a nonprofit or sometimes corporations, and that can, so all those different options can lead to different types of projects and different sectors that people might want to work on and be employed in later on. And also there are proposals from um, internal professors in Bren um, or other research labs or initiatives at UCSB also. And I think there's a history of some coming from NCs too, which if you don't know, already know about meds, it's a dual program between Bren, uh, School of Environmental Science and Management, and NCs. Um, there's a wide range of sectors, interests, topics, tools and skills in each project. Um, and so students will uh, allocate the points for which project and which interest, you know, aligns with their path in the future or what they intend to do after graduating. Um, so for example, one might be about corporate sustainability and if you're intending to work in that sector, in the you know, private sector or whatever, after graduating, that might be a project that you put more points into. So the Capstone Projects act as the culmination of our MEDS curriculum. Um, so rather than writing a thesis, we get into groups of three or four and work in winter and spring quarters on our projects and then present them at the end of spring quarter. And that's our final piece of being med students. Bye! Bye. <laughs>